Angie from Angie's Craft Corner. Today we are going to do uh, one sheet or one sheet card. Happy birthday. And um, I'm going to cut my 11 and a half by 8 and a half in half at the 5 and a half mark. I mean, I'm going to fold it. On um, second thought, we're going to use this. We're going to use more than just one. Never mind. Because we're going to have some fun. Because we're going to ink. I mean, an ink and me. Okay, this is the little bag I put my inks in. Or some inks. The um, craft ink. And I'm going to play with the purple today. As most of you know. Now, y'all, I do not like this handle. I just don't like it. Now, a lot of people that I'm just going to use the base of it. So, I'm going to lay the handle off of my desk or off my area. Because I can do so much better just with this. No, uh, it's your pre preference, I know. I mean, everybody's got their own preferences. And I understand that more than you think. I just don't like it. And I'm just going to ink the pumper around the edges of my card base. I'm going to grab a wet wipe, wash off my glass. Got glue all over it, too. I need to dry one. Okay. That being said, this will fit. And it will just give it the pump pump illusion. But I think I'm going to take this brown out of the same ink. And do this. But I'm not going to do as much. Just, just like so. The 
before we get to stamping. Okay, this is a new stamp set I got the other day from Wish.com. We're going to use this flower and uh, probably the happiest of them stay to you. <clears throat> and we'll see what else comes up from this. And I haven't even took it out of the package. I started as usual. Well, I guess it would help if I put this <laughs> the right way. Does anybody else do this? A, a, a blonde moment, I guess. And I'm going to use my black stays on ink. And then I'm going to put my saying. And I'm also going to use the black stays on ink again. going to use these markers in the purple and the green no probably need brown too and do not ask me what kind of flower this is because I have no clue I am not no flowery type of I know what roses, carnation is, and a tulip, and irises, and maybe a pansy. If I know if it looks like a pansy, I am no. I just don't do flowers. I love. I mean, I think they're pretty. I just can't grow them, so I've never been interested in them. I've got a black thumb when it comes to that. Can y'all believe it's already nearly June? Or has this year went? So, what has it? Is everybody ready for summer yet? Summer has hit Arkansas with a vengeance. Yes, you do hear the AC on in the background. I've got the craft room all shut up. I mean, I've got the quantum shut up. It's it's hot. <laughs> 
I go from our bedroom to the craft room just as fast and as possible because it's just hot. I do not like this heat. I'm ready to travel up north for the sun. <laughs> And if y'all hear me rattling around, I'm trying to find a more than I want. Mm -hmm. Just got bit by something. So. Is anybody else like I am that lives here in Arkansas down south? I mean, it is getting hot, folks. Like, it's supposed to be around 100 degrees with humidity. It's our humidity that kills us. If y'all don't have humidity, be thankful. All of the specs will be on um, AngieCraftCorner.com On, on all the supplies that I've used and it will also be down below some of the supplies will be down below Is anybody else having trouble with ants? Y'all got a good solution for ants? Let me know. Now, if you don't want to do this at Happy Birthday, you can get get well. Um, you can do different stuff. I mean, you can put different uh, sentiments on these. I'll pop, I'm thinking about doing a a card sh uh, package to show how I do those.
because I got to see so loud. I'm going to grab my pepper again. Okay. Taking art really good. If y'all ain't figured it out, I love my art really good. I use it for everything. I just realized I ain't got my wedding ring on right. I'll get it one way. Okay, I'm going to do something that I normally don't do. Y'all scared? I would be. Cut this off just a little. That's about four and a half. And like I said, all the man permits and stuff will be on the blog at angiecraftcorner.com. And I'm just going to take. right around the edges. Just lightly. I mean, I didn't even dip this in the ink. I'm looking for some pins. That's kind of just disappeared off my desk. Hmm. Okay. We'll do it this way. Let's do it with brown. It's going to be that picky. And I'm just going to put May you have a wonderful birthday. That's all I'm writing for now. And then I'm going to stick it in the middle. I just wish this one Whoa. Well. I'll have to print them that one.
I'm still using all little glue. I just put them in these little small bottles. Okay, and here's a simple, easy card. I mean, the most, what took me the longest was coloring the flower in, and y'all, y'all noticed that. And like I said, for y'all. Do you know, notice? Yes, I do wear my band, my bands on three different rings at night. It's you know morning, but I ain't got completely dressed yet. <laughs> so, anyways, I hope y'all enjoy this little uh, simple little card. I mean, it is simple. Anybody can do this. And y'all have a blessed day. Give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to us at Angie Craft Portal. And visit us at, on YouTube at Angie Craft Portal. Have a blessed, blessed day.